we want to make sure that the videos we choose get to the point we are trying to make as quickly and simply as possible. And so these are some of the elements I look for. I tend to choose videos that have little to no title sequence. If too much time is spent on presenting a title, an author, and all the people who are involved in creating the video, learners can start to wonder why they are there. I don't like to waste people's time. Another important element is making sure that we choose videos that only present the ideas that we are exploring within that specific learning situation. This can sometimes be tricky which often leads to wanting to create your own videos. We do want to make sure that if we are learning about, for example, transformations in math class, that the videos we choose talk about transformations, that they are appropriate for the level of learning as well as the content of what we are learning. Again, the idea is to be intentional and to scaffold the learning situations we create for our students. Once again, we don't want anyone wondering why they are watching that video. And finally, we want to make sure that the videos we choose simply say what needs to be said. If you think about it, each video we choose for our learners is an important piece of the story we are telling them about the course they are in. I like to make sure that each video I choose is consistent with the story I want to tell them about their program of study. 